<laughs> day off today. It's, uh, we've got no work apart from coaching later on this evening. And we've got no training to rest there. I don't know what I'm going to do with myself. So, yeah, we're going to do a couple bits and pieces today. And, of course, we've got to start the day by being here. <laughs> Told you, second home, right? Doesn't mean today. It's I haven't moved days. No, we haven't moved two days. We're getting withdrawal no. symptoms. So. We haven't been since like Saturday. It's been two days, three no, it's been days. Saturday. No, it was not Saturday. It was Saturday. No, it wasn't. It was Saturday. Anyway, so we're getting some lunch. We're gonna go eat some lunch, chill for a bit, and then we're gonna go find something to do. It's good, isn't it? It's good. It's so good. No. What's up team? Surprise, surprise, where am I? Look familiar? It's the gym. <laughs> so we've had a day just chilled out so far today. We've got a couple coaching sessions though. Um, it's all good. I love helping people out, so it's all good. It's still rest day, still not training. So we've got three three sessions that we're gonna go into in about 15 minutes, wrap up about 9 p.m. and then let the chilling commence or continue even. And uh, and then yeah, we're just chilling out today. Hope everyone's having a great day today. Um, hope everyone's as chilled out as I am. Peace. Sweet potato, broccoli, spinach, rice, curry sauce hell yes love it so we've just finished our friday friday morning cardio um was good it was a repeat metcon from last week so it was five rounds thousand meter row 20 meter bear crawl swings Kettlebell swings and 20 meter bear crawl. Three minutes rest between rounds, trying to record the time per round. Um, I was quite surprised, quite happily surprised after the first round of breaking the six minute mark, especially having to vault up the stairs to get up to where I'm doing the bear crawls and kettlebell swings. Anyway, last week the accumulated time was 30 minutes and 44 seconds for the five rounds. This week, 28 minutes and 39 seconds. So, Two minutes, five seconds quicker over the five rounds. We're looking about 25 seconds quicker per round, something like that. So, happy days, happy days. We're getting there, we're getting strong. Now, going to go get some lunch, and then uh, we're back later for some coaching. And, of course, session two. Peace. Same seagull every day. He didn't want to play. Evening. Coaching's done. Um, yet again, we're here solo run. So solo run tonight, working through the strength of the front squat to begin with. Then some strength with the hang squat clean. So a lot of front loading on the squat tonight. With then some Metcon that involves more front squat and more front rack lunging. So it's going to be quad pump for days today. It's going to be interesting. Um, going to be fun, as always. Quads feeling it a tiny bit from Wednesday night with all those lunges, but not a massive amount, not enough that I'm worried about how we're going to go into tonight. So it should be good. Get some uh, reasonably big numbers with the front squat now. Working on 90%, um, so it'll be around, I think, 100, 105, something like that. So nothing crazy, but it'd be, be good. Um, yeah, let's get it done. Let's get it done. Alright team, so that's the easy stuff done. Strength is finished. So we did um, we did the front squat and again it's following the routine of 70, 80, 90, 70. Um, this week, because of last week and how challenging the front squat was, I decided to keep the 90% 
or what should have been the 90% today, the same as what 85% was last week. So it worked out to, uh, to be 102.5. So I did the same with that this week. Um, and we're super happy because last week I only got two reps. This week I've got four reps. So something's happening, <laughs> as it keeps saying. Um, and then we've just done five sets of three hang squat clean um, with a little bit of increase from last week. So a little bit of percent increase from last week. Um, which is happy day. So last week did 65 for three of the five sets, and this week I've done 67.5 for all five sets. And to be honest, could have done a tiny bit more. Um, could have probably done 70, maybe 72 and a half. Um, but wanted to conserve for this metcon, number one metcon, which is 10 squat cleans into two minute max calorie row, three rounds for calories. So aim of the game is to keep the barbell moving, keep the barbell smooth and try and do the sets unbroken as best as possible. Obviously a little bit lighter with 60 kilo on the bar, so I'm, 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 uh, I've got wishful thinking for it. Um, I'm optimistic, we'll see what happens, but that uh, no, should be a good one. I'll get this one done and then we've got two more. Let's get it done. Said, your balls out on the road. That's all we did. There is absolutely no doubt in my mind right now that we are pushing limits. Love it. Love it. I'll reveal the secret how this is happening in a bit. <laughs> Not so much of a secret, but let me get this round done, wrap up this training, and we'll talk. Peace. on another level. Training on another level. Team Roythorn, Team Tap. Love it. Hitting new limits every day. That is what remains of me after that workout. <laughs> So yesterday I was talking about the secret, um, the secret sauce, the secret flavor, um, and what I really feel is helping me and, and taking me to the next level. I really feel like I'm, I'm taking that step up in my uh, in my CrossFit game, in my fitness, my conditioning especially is um, very very strong right now. Um, and to be honest, I put it down to. A couple of things, but the one thing I want to talk to you about today, and I'm going to talk to you about a couple other things over the next couple of days, but the one thing I want to talk to you about today is this right here, all right? Let me make sure you can see it. X Endurance, all right? Extreme Endurance, all right? By the way, I'm not endorsed by them. I'm not sponsored by them um, yet. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Now, I'm not, um, jokes aside, I'm not, so I'm not being paid to advertise them or anything like that. All right, this is an honest review. This is just my take on the product. Now, I've been taking it, well, from yesterday, I've been taking it for 12 days. So today is my 13th day, but yesterday, 12 days. And they claimed on the website throughout their um, articles and things like that that it takes 72, to, 72 hours to kick in, which I thought, wow, you know, that's, that's pretty quick. But anyway, I, I have found that even within 12 days, so they say three, but within 12 days so far, I've seen definite increase in the sense of my lactic acid buildup is is a lot less some of the things i was doing yesterday was a lot of quads now some of you all of you 
majority of you are going to know, when your quads burn, my god, they hurt, right? They hurt like hell. Come on, yeah. <laughs> and yesterday, I kept pushing, I kept pushing, I kept pushing, and it hurt. Don't get me wrong, I didn't go through the whole thing and thought, oh, this is easy, this is breeze. But I kept going. I, I was able to keep going and keep going unbroken um, on that Metcon yesterday where it was five front squats into ten front rack walking lunges into five front squats. Going through that entire thing unbroken and then hitting two minutes on the air dine was killer. And on paper, I was like, oh my God, this is going to destroy me. And it did, but not as much as I thought it would do, you know? Like, I definitely feel like I've got an edge right now. I feel like I am stepping to that next level, as I mentioned. So, definite lactic acid reduction and aerobic threshold increase, definitely. Yesterday, again, using an example of the Airdyne and then the max calorie row for two minutes, just absolutely busting the gut. Now, I stepped on that row or sat on that row and straight away started tugging. <laughs> started going as hard as I could. And it sounds silly, but for that entire duration of two minutes, I maintained that 100%. Now, two minutes at 100% or, you, you know, as hard as you possibly can, that's pretty insane. Um, so, X-Endurance, Extreme Endurance, awesome. Um, super happy. I started taking it and will continue to take it and I look forward to the next eight weeks leading up to comp and I look forward to taking it during the competition, the three weeks of competition and seeing how that feels as well um, because I know obviously when it comes to the comp workouts it is going to be balls to the wall, nothing left at the end of the day so this stuff, I can see it right now, it's helping me a ton I can see it really, really going to help me with my, well, it's in my comp prep right now, but also in competition days when they come about. So if you've seen it, if you're looking at it and you're contemplating, oh, is this going to work, is this not, try it out, seriously, because it, it has helped me a ton and it's only 12 days in, all right? Peace, team. Have a good day. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. I'm loving it. I'm here every day. Training's going awesome. I hope your training's going good too. Let me know. Shoot us a comment shoot us a message. Much love. Peace.